day to all the mothers too, man. I want to say that real quick. I'm on my way out to my mom's house, if y'all can see that there. Got her little fruit basket and stuff set up. So for all everybody that loves their mom out there, all you men, man, especially you men, women too, but make sure you guys look out for your moms on Mother's Day, man, especially if y'all had a single mother. Take care of her, man. That girl love you more than you know. Love the hell out of you too, mom. <laughs> That's my ride or die for real. But what do they say? What's known don't need to be said. She know how I feel about her already. Man, what's good, Joshua boy? What's the thing? And I'm back up in this thing, man. My car right now looking despicable, homie. Check this shit out. Y'all see all that? All the bugs going across that thing. Man, I ain't been able to drive this thing in like two weeks, so we finna get it cleaned up right now. Normally, I don't do car washes like this, but today, I just wanna get one done real quick. I ain't trying to get a good clean on my car. I'm just gonna do a little wham, bam. Thank you, man, you feel me? <laughs> So I got a quick little wash done on her. Something real quick. Just sprayed her down. Knock all the big shit off of there. I mean, my car is looking dusted. I can't be doing that no more. I ain't even dry my shit off, y'all. Normally, I always use that air chamois right there. But today, we gonna have to air dry it. All right, so as you guys already saw, I swung by my mom's for Mother's Day. Had to go say what's up to my mom. I'm gonna say it again, mom. I love you, love the hell out you. I'm back on my way to my house right now. I'm gonna see if I can't mess around and get that speaker installed today. Like I said, I've only got one of them to replace. So I'm gonna see if I can get that one pulled out today and get the new one put in. And we're gonna see what we are working with. I'll catch y'all when we get there. Now, if you guys know me, you know I never wash my car like this. Let's look at our work. Rim still filthy, but shit, she looked better than she did. Take that. A little bit of water spots. Better than it was though, for real. Man, I swear it's only been two days since I filmed the first part of this video. I got home. I was getting ready to put my rear speaker in. I wasn't exactly sure how to do it. So I typed it in real quick to see how to get it done. Basically, I found out I got to remove half of my interior now. Because of that, you guys probably won't see the video of me getting it done till, I don't know, because I'm finishing up school this week. We got finals at the end of the week, beginning of next week. So probably beginning of next week, I'll be tearing my car apart, getting that speaker installed for you guys. And I figure since I got to take so much apart, I might as well go ahead and put in the sound deadening stuff. But let me show y'all what I'm talking about on my car. Oh, awesome. Hey, backyard looking better though. So the speaker is just right here in my trunk area. So I thought it'd be no problem to get up in there and get it. As you guys can see, I got it disconnected because the right one there was blown. So yeah, I didn't think it'd be too much, but once I got to looking at it, I saw I can't remove it from underneath. So you've got to get inside of the car. 
don't mind on my gloves, y'all. Y'all see I had to toss all my used gloves back here every time I went somewhere. Let me get the wide view for y'all. I hope that ain't too grainy for y'all. My camera don't be working too well in dark spots. Anyway, so to be able to get to this rear speaker back here, I was reading online, I've got to remove the seats, both of them. I've got to take the side panels off. Then once I take those side panels off, I can remove the rear deck lid. I didn't even realize this. The speakers don't actually like have vents or nothing up here. It's just one solid plastic piece. So I've got to remove all of that. And I figure if I'm gonna remove all of this, it is gonna expose all the bare metal on the body down here. So once I expose all of the bare metal, that's when I decided I'm just gonna go ahead and put that sound deadener in here because if I'm gonna have all this removed, I might as well do it right and put the sound deadener. Otherwise, I'll probably be trying to do it later. That's a pretty big task to take on. So that's why I said probably won't be until like beginning of next week. I'll be getting a video ready for you guys with that in around that time. <clears throat> I'll be trying to do my side panels too. I don't know if I'll do them all in the same day. The main reason I even bought the sound deadener is for these side panels. So I'll probably be doing all that around the same time. I don't know if you'll see it all in the same video. So you guys definitely stay tuned for that. That'll be coming your way for show. My main homie wanna say what up to y'all too, man. Damn, you guys see the trees back there? This California weather so bipolar, man, it's crazy. I got a hoodie and everything on. Low key though, I'm hiding my quarantine hair. <laughs> like I said, I'm just grinding with school right now. I've been hunkered down the last couple days. All my classes have transitioned to online. So I've been hustling on that. But as of right now, I got straight A's. So, hey man, shout out to me on that one. I've been hustling for that for real. I just wanna give you guys an update, let you know where I'm at. Trying to pump out as many videos as I can for you guys. I apologize if maybe the quality of some of them isn't as good or maybe even just the content, but I wanna keep you guys updated, let you know where I'm at. I appreciate everybody coming through, rocking with me. We've been growing like crazy lately, man. In the last video I said something about 30. We blew past 30, so we on that road to 50, boy. I appreciate everybody in the Whisper gang. But this your boy Whisper thing. I'm about this thing, baby. Peace.